A casual burglary may not come as a shock to residents and authorities, but a burglary in a place of worship is quite surprising. Effingham police officials recently arrested four individuals who they say were involved in burglarizing and attempting to set fire to St. Anthony Church. February 9th at approximately 11 p.m., four individuals entered uh, the church and committed the uh, crimes that they're charged with. And those individuals who range in age between 14 and 19 are charged with attempted arson, burglary, and criminal damage to a place of worship. Though authorities say there wasn't a motive behind the crime, it was easy to identify the suspects once St. Anthony turned in video surveillance footage. During the course of uh, the weekend, the church was able to review the security video cameras, uh, videos and provided that to the police department. And upon us uh, looking at the video, we immediately uh, identified the individuals from prior encounters that we've had with them. With this footage, the department was also able to identify the damage done to the church which includes throwing food throughout the sanctuary and attempting to start a fire. Although the footage helped to solve the case, Feasting says the department alone works extremely hard to catch criminals. It was a, a, a great testament to our, our men and women of the Effingham Police Department. Uh, when they were called upon for this crime, they look at the video footage and they immediately knew who these individuals were. So that tells me that our officers are out on the street. They know who in our community is committing crimes and they're actively engaged in what's going on in our community. St. Anthony administration says through this tragedy, all operation hours and procedures will remain the same. Feaston says to prevent crimes like this, the department will continue to educate the community. And we continue to uh, enforce our hotspot patrols. Uh, we uh, review statistical data every week to see where uh, crimes are occurring. We map that out and we put officers in those spots to prevent harm in the community. In Effingham, I'm Jakira Smith for WEIU Newswatch.